today I'm going to be doing a video which has been requested like none other. I honestly regret the day mentioning this video because ever since after that no one has been interested in any other video except this particular video. We're talking about skincare dupes. And also I'm totally kidding, I love it when you guys send me requests because I know what exactly do I need to do and that's pretty helpful. So don't forget to leave your request in the comment section down below. So I just want to put out a few disclaimers before starting with the video. Um, first of all, we are not comparing these products ingredient by ingredient because I think it's kind of impossible to dupe skincare completely like that, like to have all of the ingredients not only because of the costs but also a lot of companies and especially higher end companies patent their products and their formulations so a lot of um, more affordable brands cannot like they legit cannot dupe the product even if they want to dupe the product now that's out of the way secondly i say this for both high end and for the more affordable side that these products have worked for me in a similar fashion they might not have worked for you even for high end your experience might not have been the best i'm just sharing my opinion and my experience with these products and thirdly the dupes might not seem as the most affordable or the cheapest product when you look at them individually but look at them from the perspective of the price of the product we're comparing them to I will list all of the prices in the bottom bar for you guys so make sure you check that out so that you guys know the MRPs of everything both the high-end and the dupe ones so yeah without any further ado and any more disclaimers to give out Let's get on with the video. Okay, first one, and this is quite popular, is the Bioderma Sensible H2O. I love this. I finished the uh, smaller version of this. This is a micellar water, and this breaks down your makeup beautifully. Again, as I said, I love this. A dupe, a cheaper alternative that is available for it is the Garnier Micellar Cleansing Water. Both of these perform pretty similarly. They remove your makeup nicely and yeah, they're micellar waters, they get rid of your makeup. Even Maybelline has a similar micellar water with pink cap and transparent packaging. You can even check that one out, it's a good micellar water, but I do prefer the Garnier one over the Maybelline. Secondly, we have face washes. The first one I have is the Kama Ayurveda Anti-Acne Cleansing Foam. Now, um, the deep that I have for it, you might have guessed it already because it's pretty similar in the packaging as well. We're talking about the Himalaya Purifying Neem Face Wash. Now, both of these are anti-acne, they're supposed to prevent your pimples both of them have neem and all of that goodness in them even their packaging is so similar and both of them are foaming as you can see i've also used the himalaya one quite a bit i've finished i think all three bottles of this i really like it because it's not it does not strip my face down to the extent that i feel my skin is sahara desert dry which it already is so yeah both of these again perform pretty similarly i wouldn't say they would treat 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 your acne but yes they would get rid of the extra bacteria that's on your face then we have some shower gels and for the high end side or the more you know pricey side we have the body shop wild argan oil shower gel i'm not comparing fragrances over here but the properties of the shower gel so even though i love body shop shower gels and i have loads of body shop shower gels my only complaint with these is that their fragrance does not last that long which like totally defeats the purpose of having a nice smelling shower gel but the dupe i have for it is the fiamma reveals shower gel now both of these are very moisturizing they do not strip your skin down i honestly though believe that i can't really make out difference in a lot of shower gels until unless the texture is completely different like it's a creme shower gel or you know that's the only other type actually but yes this is a great shower gel if you're looking for an affordable alternative and this cleanses your skin leaves you smelling fresh and good this one is the lemongrass and jojoba variant but you can definitely check out other variants this also exfoliates your skin as it has beads in it and i think there is one exfoliating shower gel from boy shop as well i'm forgetting the name my other favorites are the plum one the winter cherry plum and the rose variant british rose i love them both but just have the fragrance it should last longer okay then we have face mask and i have two Two masks to share with you guys the first one is the glam glow flash mud brightening treatment and i know you guys have been waiting for glam glow mask dupes like you guys have been legit waiting for it the dupe that i have for it is the l'oreal pure clay mask this is the argyle pro one there are a lot of commonalities in these two masks both of them are supposed to give you a nice glow while kind of refreshing your skin and making sure it's clean and all of the pimples are gone and everything both of them have exfoliating beads in them so you can kind of scrub it all over your face to ensure that there's no dead skin cells on your face both of these leave you slightly red after the application but the next day you wake up with bright and beautiful skin 
So yeah, there are a lot of commonalities here. So if you are looking for something that would give you effects of the Glam Glow Brightening Treatment, you should look into the L'Oreal one as well. Another noteworthy dupe can be the Plum Glow Getter Mask. The orange and the chamomile tea one, that's really good as well. But I do like the L'Oreal one a little bit better than that one. Next up, I have the Innisfree Super Volcanic Pork Laid Mask. And I love this mask. I freaking love this mask. It's so good. It I feel like it sucks out all of the impurities from my skin and it just leaves it looking so clean and so nice but it is on the pricier side. The dupe that I have for it is the uh, Jeva Charcoal Face Mask with Argan Oil. I know this is charcoal and this is volcanic clay and both of them are different ingredients but they perform pretty similarly. Even this one leaves your skin super clean and I've been obsessed with this one. Like I've not had this mask for the longest time but as you can see I've used so much of it. I've been obsessed especially for this season, this monsoon season. I feel like a mask like this which would suck out all of the impurities is a must. Then next on my list are toners and I specifically have a really big love relationship with toners ever since I've been to Korea. So of course I had to include a Korean toner and I have the Innisfree Green Tea Seed Skin. Um, this one basically hydrates your skin while making sure your pores look smaller and just you know just giving you beautiful glowing skin. A perfect dupe for this one is the Plum Green Tea Toner. This is alcohol free so it's safe to use for all skin types. Again this gives your skin a nice glow, it balances out your skin and hydrates it as well. So if you are looking for something that would hydrate your skin, minimize your pores and not strip your skin down, you can check any of the two out, whatever suits your budget. Time for serum. Again, another product that I fell in love with when I was in Korea. And of course, another Korean brand, one of my favorites out there, um, the Face Shop. We have the White Seed Brightening Serum. Now this serum is slightly thick. It brightens up your skin and it just feels so good. Sometimes I skip a moisturizer after this because it feels so good. You shouldn't do that, honestly. Especially with a skin type like mine, you shouldn't. But some days I can because it's just so nice and it brightens up your skin so I love this one but if you are looking for a dupe we have another plum dupe this is the Illuminance the Bright Mixed Face Serum very similar in the texture and the consistency I would say this is slightly more gel like while this is slightly cream like but it brightens up your skin gives it a boost and a glow um, you know bomb on the skin and I really like both of these so if you are looking for a brightening serum, you have choices right here. Aloe vera gel, of course the best dupe for any store aloe vera gel would be like having an aloe vera plant at your home and taking out your own gel. But A, that first of all is time consuming and B, not all of us have the space for an aloe vera plant. Personally for me, I feel it's pretty time consuming and sort of messy. So I just buy aloe vera gel whenever I can. Uh, for the high-end side and this would be slightly you know shocking to you because this brand is not super super high-end but when it comes to aloe vera gel i actually got a product which was half the price of this one so of course i had to include it so i'm talking about the lakme 95 natural aloe aqua gel and the dupe i found for this one was the jeva organic and pure aloe vera gel this is 50 grams this is 100 grams this is already double the price so you know you're getting a lot of product at half the price of this one so yeah and if you want to go even cheaper of course just grow an aloe vera plant in your home and take out your own gel that's the best actually next up i have moisturizers and i have two moisturizers i'm going to give you one dupe for both of them the first one i have is the clinique moisture surge one of my all-time favorites for a really long time and the second one i have is the glam glow water burst hydration uh hydrated glow moisturizer now both of these are big on hyaluronic acid and all of those nice things so both of them are very gel like consistency gets absorbed into your skin quickly doesn't feel greasy and all of that and the dupe i have for you guys is the it skin hyaluronic acid moisture cream pretty similar in consistency that same gel like consistency that gets absorbed into your skin leaves you with glowing skin and i think they're the same sizes like all of them are 50 ml and this is also 50 ml so you get a similar dupe at a way cheaper price this one i really like i really really like this one and it's great for oily skin people dry skin people all skin people because hyaluronic acid it moisturizes your skin without it being weighed down so yeah this one is a must grab you guys the next one I have is another Glam Glow product. We have the Glam Glow Volcasmic Matte Glow Moisturizer. Now this one, what it's supposed to do is it's a moisturizer, but again, it's mattifying. So it's also going to give you a nice glow, but not be greasy at all. It smells like orange popsicles. Love the fragrance. Love, love, love the fragrance. And the dupe that I have for it is pretty, pretty, pretty cheap, guys. It's the Clean and Clear Oil Free Moisturizer. Now both of these don't give you that drip in and oil kind of a glow. They're very subtle in the glow and they moisturize your skin. 
both of them do the job pretty nicely so yes if you are looking for a cheaper alternate for this one check this one out but of course this one smells way better i love the fragrance of this one and the last product i have for you guys are hand creams again i'm going to give you one single dupe for two hand creams the first one is minus 417 hand moisturizer and the second one is the L'Occitane hand cream. This is the lavender variant. I used this one previously as well, not the biggest fan I would say. But this 417 one is pretty damn nice but super expensive. Expensive to the point I'm just like why? But anyway, the dupe that I have for it is the Face Shop Rose Water Hand Cream. This does come in a lot of different variants. I love the fragrance of these ones. Both of these, like all three of these moisturize your hands. They keep them soft and nice. I'm addicted to hand creams. You can see I've used a lot of this one because I, I can't, as I said, I need hand creams on my hands at all given points. So yeah, this is a really nice hand cream and at a way more affordable price. So yes, that was my video on skincare dupes. I hope you guys enjoyed it and it was helpful for you in some or the other way. You gotta know about some hidden gems out there and if it was, then don't forget to comment and subscribe. It would mean the world to me. Let me know if you'd like to see more such videos. Comment below, let me know and I will see you guys next time. Till then, take care. I love you all so much. Bye.